good evening friends today we saw a gap down opening of 125 points in the nifty till 130 in the afternoon nifty was struggling but later we saw a strong pullback in the nifty today was the f and o expiry and we saw short covering in sectors like power oil and gas bank and metals amid weak global queues the domestic indices opened on a negative note and remained in the negative territory for the most part of the session. However, last hour buying erased all the intraday losses to help the bourses close with 68.5 up in the Nifty. When the market closed, Dow Jones Industrial Average was up by 70 points, Nasdaq was up by 69 points, SGX Nifty was flat and Brent was down by $1.55. The top gainers for today, first one was the Bharti Airtel. It was up by 2.39% due to the news that it plans to list a payment bank. Isher Motors was also up by 2.17 points. It saw some short covering. SBF was up by 1.79 points. Most of the banks were up today and Bank Nifty was very strong today. The top losers for today was Apollo Hospital was down by 1.4%, Tata Motors was down by 1.38% and Titan was down by 1.04%. So both these Tata group companies were in the top 3 of nifty losers. The advanced decline ratio was 1 is to 1 means uh, for 50% of the stocks in the nifty were in the red and 50% of the stocks in nifty were in the green. The bank nifty closed with 763 points upside. On the news of lower cement prices, the stocks like Sri Cement, JK Cement, the cement stocks were also in the red. So this is all what happened today in the nifty. Thank you.